Hi everybody, I'm Debbie Soap and I'm inviting you along to my soaping journey. I hope you will um, subscribe and like my posts that I do, my videos. So I hope you enjoy the videos that I make and you keep on following me. Thanks everybody, bye! Hi everybody, I'm back again and today I am going to do another attempt of my, um, what is it called, the strainer swirl. But this time I've got a little mould here. I don't know how this is going to work with this paper so I put a plastic bag underneath it just in case. And I'm going, and I've already done everything because my battery is going flat and I couldn't be, and I wanted to do it now. So, and this is the strainer I'm going to use. So in different. So all I've done is I've poured them into here. My colours into here and I'm just going to pour it in. Just like so. And pull it up. Just let it come out. Okay, as you can see it's thickened up at the top there. So it's going to be a bit gooey, gooey, gooey in the top there. I wonder if I can just, I'm going to... <laughs> I want to get the rest of this into here. Just rest that there for a second. I don't like wasting soap. Right. I don't know how I'm going to do this. <laughs> okay. Now, that's going to be too thick. So I will use those in a little one. And I'll just go over here and bang. And I'll... So that is all banged. Spray with my alcohol spray. Okay, now before my battery dies, okay, I'll see what I can get in here. Um, this recipe is the same as the recipe that I used in the other strain of swirl, so just have a look on there to see what I used in that. But the colors I have used are um, sunflower which is the yellow wine sprinkle which is that really browny kind of color and um, frostbite which is the blue and the fragrance I and those are all from Micah Your World the fragrance I have used is this lovely fresh cut roses from Zen Design it is, smells so lovely it reminds me of my Nana so I think I had to call this soap Nana <laughs> um, yes so that's that and I will bring you back tomorrow with the cutting bye everybody Okay, we are back again with the cutting of it. <laughs> um, that actually did not take long. It's not even been 24 hours. It's still the same night. So, but it hardened up really quick. Okay, there is that one. This is the, a little, I just, was the excess stuff. It's just a little rose. <laughs> um, and I'm actually, I think I'll give that actually to my auntie. And let's see how this comes out of this. Pretty, isn't it? <laughs> Let's see how we're we going to do this, people. 
<laughs> Cut there. That is what it looks like that way. But that's not what we're after. What we're after is in the middle. So I'll cut here. So there is that. That's quite cool. I won't cut that again. <laughs> and my knife is so sharp, so be very careful. And there's that one. So it's a quite a cool pattern. Um, just trying to think. So it will be thin ones, so I might just cut it back like this. Yes, I'm talking to myself. I'm having a discussion with myself. Ugh. Deciding how I'm going to do it. Because the soaps are quite... Um, I mean, because I didn't make a big, thick, thick one, so I can't just have little, skinny little ones, so, yeah. So there'll be... Still skinny, but they'll be bigger. So it's, it's different. <laughs> bit smudged that one because of when I just took it off then. ones because it's kind of got the see these little patterns there see how it's got those little patterns there I like that See, that's quite a cool one. I will need to um, tidy these up a bit. And once I've tidied them up a bit, I will take some photos of them because I need to give them a bit of a... Because um, I've got a bit of smudges in them at the moment from the unusual way I cut them. Uh, yeah, so there are they. Ah, um, I quite like these ones here. I do. Well, actually, I quite like, you know, see, that's cool. I like the pattern that they've got them. I do. It's just different, that's all. <laughs> okay, thanks, everybody. Bye.